Hey, good Friday evening to all of you. I'm forecaster Nick Dunn here. Quick look at your Friday night and Saturday forecast. Tonight looking pretty good. Tomorrow, not so much. we got plenty of rain on the way. We'll track that out for you in just a couple of moments. But we'll show you that system that will be heading our way across our area right now. We're pretty dry. No complaints, some clouds out there, but otherwise it's just a little bit on the chilly side for some of you. Otherwise, most of us are fairly mild. Our next system out across Illinois, Missouri, Kansas, you've been seeing some severe thunderstorm and tornado watches and even a couple severe thunderstorm warnings. The severe weather, not going to come our way. The heavy rain, yes, that's coming our way for the daytime tomorrow, and we'll track all that out for you in just a moment. Temperatures, though, right now, as I said, upper 40s, a little chilly to the northeast, Cleveland, Youngstown, Sandusky, Asheville still checking into the 40s. The warm spots right now, Muncie and Zanesville checking in still into the 60s. And everybody else is into the 50s. Temperatures will fall into the 40s and 50s for tonight. So not really very uncomfortable, very seasonable for this time of the year. We'll go ahead and track out the rain for you now and show you when you can expect the rain to get into your neck of the woods. Here's a look at the model for midnight tonight. Again, maybe a couple sprinkles to our north and west, if that. I think that's a bit overdone. We get towards your early morning hours tomorrow. Here's 6 a.m. Some light rain to our north and west Finley, Fort Wayne, maybe up towards Toledo. Not really a big deal. Very light nuisance kind of rain showers. We get towards mid-morning. Again, mainly still to our north and west. But you're going to watch that rain is going to really start to fill in as we get into the early afternoon hours. We'll stop the clock here at 3. Just before 4 o'clock, you're starting to see some more rain, especially to our south. A couple pockets or even a couple rumbles of thunder are even possible for tomorrow, especially south of Interstate 70. Get you through the evening hours steady to heavy rain, especially along I-70 by about 6, 7, 8 o'clock. So kind of keep an eye out for that. There will be a few dry pockets from time to time. This is not going to be a constant rain for everybody. For some places it will be, but not for everybody. We get towards midnight, pretty steady to almost widespread rain for everybody. Again, just a few dry pockets here and there. Otherwise, you're seeing a lot of pockets of yellows and oranges and even a couple pockets of maybe some thunderstorm activity by Cincinnati towards midnight, 1 o'clock on Sunday morning. We continue to watch steady and even at times heavy rain for just about everybody by 4 o'clock Sunday morning. The good news is if you have any plans on Sunday, they're going to be indoors again, but it'll be nice to just kind of stay inside and kind of maybe enjoy a movie or something like that. But if we get towards late morning on Sunday, steady to heavy rain showers, especially off to our east, much lighter showers for everybody else. And watch as we get towards afternoon on Sunday. Get towards Sunday evening dinner time. Our northern and northwestern counties are starting to dry out, and the back edge of that precipitation is starting to sweep through pretty quickly. If we get towards 9, 10, 11 o'clock by midnight, most of us, if not all of us, are dry. So that's some good information there. How much rain are we talking? Well, again, most of us are going to likely see that one to two inches. Here's the outlook from the Weather Prediction Center, especially from about Richmond to Cleveland and points south and east. One to two inches of rain expected. Much lighter totals. They drop off pretty quick the, the further to the north and west you go towards places like Fort Wayne and Toledo, maybe no more than a half of an inch. But we could see some minor flooding or some standing water spots we get in towards Sunday and maybe even early next week some rises on your rivers and creeks. Looking at your Saturday afternoon forecast for highs, again, heavier rain across portions of I-70 and points south, especially later into the day and into the evening hours, otherwise lighter showers to our north. Highs tomorrow in the 50s to the north and west, 60s for everybody else. Again, we should get into the 60s because we should be seeing that rain arriving a little bit later, so that gives us a little bit of time to warm up. Thanks for tuning into this video forecast. Stay dry out there tomorrow, and we'll see you back here next time.